Jonathan Tazers on full charge. Sorry, there's no way to get up to the Raptor pen until the new generator gets unpacked and built. Hi there, it's me, Mr. BNA, and I'm here to help you. Start it with your stun rod. By the way, whatever you do, don't try licking the ends of these things. Mm. I want tasers on full charge. Come on, who tore up the cage trap? I tell you, that raptor ain't budging until it gets fixed. So, do you know what we do if the raptor escapes? Yeah, well, Goon says to get up somewhere high. We only use our weapons as the last Oh, so there's a proper plan. Huh. I was just gonna push you over to distract it and then run. Actually, I was, uh, I was gonna do that to you, too. <laughs> Pushing team, move in there. Cage ladder's jammed. Somebody punch in the security code again, will ya? Good luck. I can't figure that panel out at all. Joffrey, raise the gate.
Velociraptor? No, not Velociraptor. Maybe one of the other dig sites has turned up something. Oh, I can feel it. There's a raptor right under here. Yep. I am bang on target. I just gotta keep digging for a couple of... Oh, come on! It was there? I was so close! Who else you're after? Yeah, it's good shape, too. I want partial credit for that thing. It's basically mine. Forget to bring scissors. Remember, Dr. Settler and Grant want us to be especially careful when digging up this fossil. I say, not as I do. Next time, I'm just bringing a sandblaster. Maybe I can help. Is this thing glued in there? Come on, move! Phew. I'll be extinct by the time I get this thing out. Yeah. A jackhammer? Oh, now we're talking. I promise I'll be careful. Uh, that might need some assembly. Six-inch retractable claw, like a razor, on the middle toe. <laughs> Dr. Grant! Dr. Ellie! We're ready to try again! I hate computers. Feelings mutual. Uh, uh, uh. 
I give up. You give it a try. This does look like a tricky one. Uh, be careful. That rope's holding up, uh, some, you know, uh, oh, no, what's it called? Uh, no, it's delicate equipment. That's it. It was holding up a bunch of delicate equipment. Oh, uh, sorry. Huh? Huh? I found a perfectly preserved Compsognathus thigh. Really? Hey, I figured out what's wrong with it. It should have two wheels, not one. And handlebars. That's why you fell off of it, Dave. No handlebars. Thanks. Yeah, that should stop it from leaning over and going around in circles all the time. Maybe I can help. That's great. Now it looks like the picture in the instructions. Shoot the radar into the ground and the bone bounces into the back. This program is in front of that. That thing looks like a six foot turkey. Think you are. Ah! <laughs> John Hammond. I own an island. Kind of biological preserve. Really spectacular. Spared no expense. Our attractions will drive kids out of their minds. If I could just persuade you to sign off on the park, I could get back on schedule. What kind of park is this? It's right up your alley. So you two, um, dig up, dig up dinosaur? <laughs> well... Try to. <laughs> You'll have to get used to Dr. Malcolm. He suffers from a deplorable excess of personality, especially for a mathematician. Chaotician, chaotician, actually. <laughs>